My name is Christine Knaus and I'm a third year PhD student at Hornpoint Laboratory. I like working at the hatchery and at UMSI's because there's a lot of freedom to be able to study many different things and so there are a lot of people here doing very different things from each other but that only enhances all the learning that happens and because we are such a small community we get to learn a lot from each other. I am studying how microplastic pollution is affecting oysters in the Chesapeake Bay. This is important because uh, about 8 million tons of plastic reach the ocean every year and that weighs as much as uh, I think 53,000 school buses. So it's an insane amount of plastic that's getting to the ocean and it's breaking down to small pieces that are available for lots of marine life to eat and we don't know what that does to the ecosystem, to any of these organisms uh, or uh, human health. Plastics uh, get into the water in many ways. Uh, one is through the wastewater treatment plant, having small pieces get through um, because many wastewater treatment plants aren't designed to get rid of plastic. Other ways are trash or landfills, anything that blows um, into the ocean or people actually dumping plastic in the ocean. To help the environment and reduce um, plastic waste getting to the ocean, people can uh, use reusable bags at grocery stores instead of using plastic bags. They can uh, refuse plastic straws at restaurants and bars um, and reduce plastic uh, in their daily lives in any, any other way that's easy. I got into environmental science uh, because I was fascinated with the ocean when I was a little kid. and kind of never grew up and going from playing with toys to now more sophisticated, more expensive toys. Um, I just love trying to solve this problem that humans have created and I think, you know, we'll have the solution for it.